In this video, I'm going to show you how to check for a TPM on your computer in Windows 10, as well as making sure it's activated and secure boot being enabled. For checking to make sure your computer has a TPM, the easiest way to do it in Windows is to come down here and type in Device Manager, and then come down to Security Devices. Now, if your computer has a TPM installed, you'll see it down here. If it does not, it'll either be missing, or if you have a driver error with Windows 10, you'll have an error next to that. And then checking to make sure that the TPM is turned on, you hold down the Windows key and the R key, and you'll get a little menu down here. And you're going to type in tpm.msc, click OK. As you can see on my computer, my TPM is ready to use, along with other various information about the manufacturer. Now checking to make sure Secure Boot is enabled, if you come down here to the Windows search, type in Windows PowerShell, you're going to right click and run as administrator. And then when this menu pops up, you're going to paste the following into the command prompt and go ahead and click enter. So mine came up as true, which means my secure boot is enabled. If it comes up as false, the computer supports secure boot, but secure boot is currently disabled. If you get an error saying CMDLET not supported, that means secure boot isn't supported on your particular computer. And if you get an error, that it was unable to set proper privileges, access was denied. That means Windows PowerShell was not running administrator mode.